Tonight, businesses are adjusting to a change in mask mandates across St. Louis City and County. Thanks for joining us. I'm Corey Stark. And I'm Samantha Jones. New at 5 News 4 is asking if ditching mask mandates will free up restaurants to allow more customers. Our Russell Kinsall has been checking in with local businesses today to learn how they'll handle those changes. He joins us live from Clayton. Yeah, right now I'm in Clayton. I'm outside a restaurant called Frida's. You can see some people outside enjoying the outdoor dining. Um, the owner here and owners of restaurants, people that run big venues, they're all trying to figure out how they uh, respond to these new mask guidelines. How do they incorporate them into how they run their businesses? Some have made decisions, some have not. Well, the owner here said she is making some changes to the way she, uh, her employees are going to operate, the way her customers are going to operate. But some of the customers said, hold on, we're not going to take things too fast. It's been a really, really long 13, 14 months for every single one of us. Natasha Kwan is the owner of Frida's and Diego's Cantina next door. Some of her customers are excited about the new freedom for those who've been vaccinated. I know I've been vaccinated, so I feel very comfortable myself uh, without wearing a mask. In light of the mask mandate being lifted for those who've been vaccinated, she's allowing servers to go without wearing a mask if they can prove they got the shot. And she's easing up on the mask mandate for vaccinated customers. We trust people that if they are not vaccinated, they will continue to wear their masks uh, until they get to their table. But those people that have been vaccinated could come into the restaurant with no mask. Since masks and social distancing are still required for those not vaccinated, rather than question each customer, Quan will continue the social distancing for indoor seating, which means she won't be able to go to full capacity anytime soon. Some of her vaccinated customers weren't ready to shed their masks yet. For myself, I'm going to keep wearing a mask. Um, my goal is to model good public health for other people. Under the new CDC guidelines and at this restaurant, whether you're vaccinated or not, will be on the honor system. And that's one of the problems that I think we're going to have with these new rules is that how will you know who's been vaccinated and who hasn't been? It's on the honor system. So uh, one thing both city and county officials kept stressing at a press conference today where they announced these new guidelines is that we're not out of the woods yet. There's still a pandemic and they really stress that people who have not been vaccinated need to get vaccinated. But the question is this, if there are fewer people wearing masks, could we see an uptick in COVID cases? The answer I got from the head of the pandemic task force coming up all noon at six. Live in Clayton, Russell Kinsall, News 4.